This is the Digitally Rebastered Network. Space, the final frontier. These are the voyages of the Starship Falcon. Its ongoing mission, to explore strange new worlds, to seek out new life forms and new YouTube subscriptions, to boldly go where no show has gone before. Greetings, Trek heads, and welcome to another episode of Trek Tracks with me, your host, Eli Williams. And this week, we are continuing the Delta Quadrant campaign with the mission, The Dragon's Deceit. Let's get to it. And here we are. Fighting the Vaudoir again, I'm sure, because they are such a delight. Okay, we got the Voyager, rendezvous with Admiral Tuvok. All right. Okay, am I... I guess I'm a little bit bigger than the Voyager, I didn't realize. Okay. Greetings. It is agreeable to work with you again. Okay, you too. The Vaudoir you have too. greatly expanded their reach since Voyager first encountered them. Their military capabilities have developed at a rate that Starfleet Command finds troubling. An right. additional concern is that some leaders of the Vaudoir supremacy have developed unusual physical characteristics. These individuals exhibit strength and resilience far and I hope the this is a landing party mission. The crew of the Lisette has shared their data of your previous All encounter right. with one of the okay. enhanced. Not yet, but we have found a location that may have the answers we seek. Officially, Cartella is a defunct mining colony. However, intercepted messages indicate... The okay, we're following the Voyager. The Hazari will provide a modified hollow emitter that should allow you to approach the planet. Hollow technology is unfamiliar to the Vaudoir. All right. Man, I hope there's no space battle in this. I am tired of getting my butt kicked by the Vaudoir. And here they are. Fantastic. If you don't want to blow this whole deal, help me with these Vaudoir. Okay, one down. Okay, almost. Two down. Three down. Four down. Okay. Hail Bounty Hunter. <laughs> well. Thanks for the help, but don't expect a discount. I wouldn't have been in that mess if I hadn't been waiting here for you. I picked up this device called a hollow emitter from a big-eared fellow named Quinn. It's programmed uh, to replicate the of a Vaudoir freighter. I don't know the specifics of this technology, but 
it works, and I'm delivering it. That completes my contract. Okay. It was my own fault. I should have activated it before I entered the system. But hooking it into our power supply was more complicated than Quinn said it would be. Oh! Skip some. Oh well. Warp 2, Cartella Prime. Let's go get it on. Alright. We Ooh. have arrived at Cartella Prime. Your engineers have installed the hollow emitter and it is ready to activate at your command. We Fly to the security perimeter. To bypass the automated security perimeter. Um Oh. Messed it up. Override security net. Alright. Uh, looks like we got another one over here. Okay, enter the traffic control proximity zone. Next, we will be challenged by the orbital traffic control. Convinced car contact traffic vessel. control. Your transponder may be malfunctioning. Please transmit your ship designation and flight plan. What is the nature of your emergency? I cannot clear a vessel without an authenticated transponder code. I will dispatch an engineering crew to assist with your repairs, but you cannot dock without me. You're cleared for docking, sir. Yeah, that's what I thought. Now we must avoid detection from the Vodmore ships. The hollow emitter will be essential. Oh, well, I'm exposed. Hopefully I can get uh, where I need to be without them seeing me. I don't think so, though. Okay. This should be sufficient to repair the hollow emitter. Okay. Gotta get into this zone here. The tunnels beneath the planet are protected by a subspace scattering field that our transporters cannot penetrate. All just right. What's well, just me? Perimeter. Fantastic. I have accessed their internal sensors, so I will provide you with tactical assistance throughout your mission. Be sure that the patrol is in the correct position before you activate the console, or this will fail. Logs at the facility indicate it is in poor repair and has suffered several... Okay. Oh, what's in this? I am detecting a Vodwar patrol ahead. Maintain your position until they pass. Right. That should keep the patrol occupied. All right, we got to go over here. I am detecting another group of Vodwar ahead. Access the security camera from the console nearby. data tower. The Vodmar patrol will investigate. Program the door to seal them in. 
Alert. Conduit malfunction on level 2 section beta. Engineering teams respond immediately. All right. Excellent. Proceed cautiously. I better get my rifle out. What's that? Okay. Let's see, where are we going? Um... I guess this way. There is a large drop ahead on your right. You will need a grapple gun to cross it. Wow, that's cool. You will need to incapacitate all of the Bodwar ahead. Insert the anesthesine gas canister I provided you in the environmental control console and alter the air composition. All right. Alert. Environmental control malfunction on level two, section Delta three. Engineering and medical teams, please respond. I got the grappling thing stuck to me. Glitched there out. There is a large drop ahead. You will have to rappel down. Okay. This is wild. I've never seen, like, your characters do this kind of thing in the game before. Okay. You need to traverse this cavern without the bot or seeing you and raising the alarm. To do so, you will need to use your grapple gun, as well as take advantage of anything in the environment. This is like Sneaky Pete. Like rogue stuff. First, you will need to reach the support platform. Shoot a grapple across and then zip line down. Sneak up behind that guard and incapacitate him. Okay. Disable the proximity sensors. That console should allow you to do so. Now zip line to that outcropping. I <laughs> got the thing stuck to me. All right. This is crazy. In order to exit this cavern without detection, you will need a distraction. We will need to move the Vodwar guards below and ahead of you, away from the next support structure. The rocks near you are unstable. Try to trigger a collapse. The way is clear for you to grapple to the next support structure. Look <laughs> at all the lines stuck to me that are glitched out. Support structure. Reach third support and navigate ledges. Okay. Grapple to the next support structure. Approach the guard and disable. There are more guards at the other platform. 
Use your tricorder to reprogram the anti-personnel turrets near them to attack the Vodwar targets. Okay. Malfunctioning turrets on level 4, section beta 2. Security and engineering team, report immediately to level 4. Okay. The walkway is offline. You will need to grapple across the gap. Alright. They are aware of your actions. You cannot delay. Sensors are reading something large blocking your route through the cavern. Activate the crane with the nearby controls to move it. Not much further. There is another grapple ahead. Drop down just ahead of your current position. Now slip quietly out of the cavern before the Vodwar see you. All right. I am detecting some unusual signals coming from below this area. You must reach the bottom of the caverns. I recommend you overload a console to create. Okay. Overloading a console. I'd be this one right here. Intruder alert! Commander Gallic, please respond! An intruder? I'll handle this. Okay, I bet you will. Okay. Whoa, what's going on with me? Oh no. Finally. What is this thing on you me? Will pay for killing Gallic. What? Oh, it's one of them things. Yeah, from next gen. my life. I don't know why, but I am grateful. 
Well, generally, when your life is saved, you're grateful. It Never. It's some kind of parasite, isn't it? What do you know? Do you believe other members of the Vaudoir? Now, last time we saw them things, there was a guy uh, Could all of our leaders getting his head blown off. Contaminated? I know my duty. I cannot allow you to wander freely through our compound. But I can't ignore this either. I think it went down that passage over there. Let's go get it. It went down one of the cracks in the rock. We'll have to deactivate that force field to pursue it. Okay. already left the area. I would recommend you scan the area with your tricorder. Perhaps it left a hormonal tr All right. I see it. I didn't know these caves were so extensive. Only the highest leadership is allowed down here. How did the Vaudoir come into contact with the Parasites in the first place? It has been many years since Starfleet encountered them. I wonder how many of our leaders have been infected. Surely Gala can't be the only one. Okay, this way. Based on Starfleet's previous encounters with the this Parasites... This thing got a long way really cautious. quickly. The creatures show remarkable cunning. Give me an enemy I can confront face to face. This deception sickens me. They are insidious. These creatures nearly ended the Federation. Although we have had our differences with the Vaudoir, the Federation do not wish to see any species enslaved. Oh. This area has always... This area has always been off limits. I expected some kind of hive. Okay. Scan canisters. Oh, I see him up there. What was that thing? Wait, a bunch of them. Did you hear something? Oh, there's going to be a great big one. We're gonna have to fight a giant one. Oh no, I ah, guess not. I see you've met my little friends. They want to get to know you better. What are you? How far has this infestation spread? You have such a small mind. The joining will help. You will see everything we can be once we yeah. have others under the skin. Oh boy. Oh, I'm gonna die. Switch to the pistol. I'm not doing enough damage. Ah. <laughs> Got him. You think you are best in me? Mere mortals. We will rise again. That's a weird looking gun. We'll know our true fight. This ends now. 
I cannot allow you to spread this infestation. Yep, well, that's tasty. looks terrible. <laughs> this just looks terrible. Okay. Oh! Oh no! Yeah, now we're gonna have to fight a big one. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. I just knew it. Okay. Subspace scattering field and disable. I ain't leaving until I get that loot. the Vaudoir people today. Do not know. I must remain with my people. Perhaps I will discover more of what's really happening here. Your activities on the surface have alerted the Vaudoir to your presence. They are beginning to inspect the starships in orbit. Okay, let's go up and get ready for a big Vaudoir fight. The information you discovered in the base is troubling. While Starfleet knew the neural parasites Maybe not. on Earth sent a signal to deep space before they were destroyed, we never knew the destination. Okay. Lie to the edge of the system. Unidentified vessel. Your transponder codes are invalid. Security vessels are on there. There is only a 0.008% chance that this ship will survive a direct confrontation. One last act of sabotage may be what is required. Okay. Chip moved out of range. We know at least some of the Vaudoir have been taken over by the neural parasites. We can form an appropriate plan right. of action. Thank you again. Live long and prosper. You as well, sir. 
All right, kids, let's go. All right, that would mean it is turn in time. The existence of the neural parasite certainly explains the unusual physical abilities of the Vagwar. Let's Perhaps see. Return to prominence in the Stealth operational you armor. To take out two of their overseers, but I expect that more of their leadership has been infected. Hello. Congratulations. Oh, you have time to look into something for me. Okay. The data from your mission against the Vadwar shows they're a bigger threat than we ever anticipated. Off. Hello. Okay. Well, four more, uh, four more levels, and we are maxed, guys. So good deal there. Nice successful mission. Very little space battle. No damage to my ship. No blowy blowy uppy uppy. So good deal there. I'm glad you guys could be along with me on this. Thanks for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Curse, smash that bell so you can get information on all the good things coming out of the digitally rebastered network. You've been watching Trek Tracks with me, your host, Eli Williams. You all have a great week and a great day. I will see you next time, and until then, live long and prosper. On behalf of the Digitally Rebastered Network, I would like to thank you for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to curse smash that bell so you can get information on all the good things coming out of the Digitally Rebastered Network. You have been watching Trek Tracks with me, your host, Eli Williams. Be sure to tune in next time. And until then, I hope you all live long and prosper. This has been a DRN production.